Hi YouTube, happy Thursday. I just wanted to show you all the ribeye steaks I got for dinner tonight. I have um, washed them and placed them on the uh, baking pan, broiler pan, and I have pierced them already with a fork so that the meat tenderizer that I'm about to sprinkle on will have an opportunity to uh, permeate the meat. I'm going to set these to marinate uh, while I'm at work so that by the time I come home they're ready to be begin um, cooking. I have the Creole seasoning, the more spice seasoning, some meat tenderizer that's seasoned, and uh, Montreal steak McCormick um, seasoning, and some onion powder since you all are aware how much I like onions. So I'm going to um, apply the ingredients to both sides and wrap them for marinade. I'll see you back in a bit. The steaks are all seasoned. I mentioned that I already pierced the steaks. When I say I pierce them, I just run the fork back and forth across horizontally and then vertically. That way when I sprinkle the seasonings, there are um, openings for the seasonings to permeate the meat. So now I will wrap everything up in saran wrap and put it in the refrigerator to marinate while I'm at work. See you back soon. Well, I'm back home from work. The steaks have marinated. The spices have melted into the meat. And I'm going to put them into the uh, broiler now to broil. And then I'll turn them over. Um, while they're broiling, I'm going to microwave bake the potatoes. And I'm going to show you how I'm going to slice those in just a minute. Here's the potatoes. I'm not using my tripod, so I'm just going to show you what I'm going to do. There's a plastic plate underneath, um, upside down, so I have a, a, a kind of a mounted up surface to cut on. I have two wooden spoons on each side of the potato so that the knife doesn't go all the way through. So that when I bake it, it will open up in kind of a fan shape and I'm going to spray uh, butter spray on it and put some coating. Now you can put any coating that you want. I used to like to use onion um, soup mix, Lipton onion soup mix, uh, and it would make for a lovely um, baked potato and then you can add butter, you can add your sour cream, anything you like, ketchup, your favorite um, topping for it. So that's why I'm going to make the potatoes. I'm going to make three of them sliced spray them and I'm going to use herb and garlic soup mix uh, to sprinkle on them to give them that extra additional uh, bang of flavor make it really tasty back with you soon here's the um, Lipton savory herb with garlic soup mix and these mixes are great to use with your slow cooker as the package shows and I've sprayed the potatoes first with the spray butter and this is how they look. I'll cover them and put them in the microwave on three potato setting and very soon we'll have a lovely dinner. These are Yukon Gold Potatoes. Dinner's just about ready. Here's one plate. I have the ribeye steak broiled the baked potato, I put um, butter in the slits that you see there. I decided to slice some mozzarella and tomato, alternating slices, and dress it with balsamic vinaigrette. We have Klaus Dubois Merlot um, as an accompaniment, and we'll have apple pie if we have any room left for dessert. Uh, dinner is ready. Hope you try this recipe, it's delicious. It should be great tonight. 